YouTubers, welcome back to Rosie's Reviews. Today I'm going to be reviewing my Birch Box for November 2015, and here it is. Kind of has that leopard skin teal look to it. Um, and I'll let's just break open the box and let's look and see what our products were this month. Um, the theme this month, I'm trying to see if there's actually a theme. I don't know that there was really a theme. Um, it's just happy November. Okay. <laughs> All right. We'll start with uh, this Airs Body Polish. There's the, the little label on top. This uh, full The full size of this uh, retails for $25. And I'll open it up here. I've used this somewhat, as you can tell. It's almost it's toward the bottom. But I'll give you a little sample of what it looks like. If you can see there, um, it's a body polish to use. I use in the shower. Um, it has little granulars in it. I like to call this an exfoliant for your skin, for your body. And you are uh, meant to put this on after you wash your body, put it on to just exfoliate um, and get rid of all the gunk, the dull skin and stuff. I think this is called papaya something, sunrise maybe is the, is the smell. It smells really good. Um, I don't know how I feel about it as, as an ex a body polish. Uh, now some people have mentioned that they use this when they shave their legs. So that's a possibility that might work. Um, but I didn't really notice a huge difference in my skin. Now I will say this and you know in the most humble way I can. Like I don't really have a lot of issues with rough skin. My hands get dry in the winter time but I'm very good about moisturizing. I try to drink a lot of water, and so I don't really have a lot of issues with dry skin, um, except for certain areas, so um, like my hands and stuff, and sometimes my face. But so I might have noticed a difference in this if I really had some issues with like some dull skin and needed to like you know freshen it up. So the smell is great. I love the smell. Uh, the smell's wonderful, um, and I think overall it's a pretty good product. I would give it about a B. All right, and the next thing here is this is a Davy a Davines product hair product. It's the Davines. This is relaxing moisturizing fluid, and this is a, a I guess probably the uh, fourth product of Davines I've I've used. I've had their shampoo conditioner. I have a, had another texturizing spray. And I'll just kind of show you a little bit of what the, the gel looks like. Um, there it is on my finger. It's creamy, kind of a creamy fluid. Um, it's meant for you to put in your hair before you blow dry um, to help kind of moisturize and calm down the frizzes and that kind of thing. Well, right now I'm wearing my hair kind of shorter than I normally do. And so I didn't notice a huge change using this uh, Davines product. But I liked it, and you know, the protection, I don't blow dry my hair a ton. I just do it to kind of get the, you know, get the dampness out. So it's hard for me to really tell, you know, how these work. But um, it did give my, my hair some volume, but not much. Uh, it doesn't take a lot. Um, I did use a little too much the first time, and it was almost too greasy for me, and that's because my hair's short. But um, all of these types of, I've gotten a lot of these types of samples that you put in your hair before you blow dry, and none of them really stick out to me as, oh my gosh, that's my favorite. Um, they, they're all great, and I'll use all of them, um, you know, all of them as samples. I doubt that I would ever buy this. This full size of this uh, retails for $26. Okay, now this is my winner winner chicken dinner product in my birch box. And it's I've opened it and used it. It's the Dr. Jart Water Rep Replenishment 1X Cotton Facial Mask. There, we, we only got one a one use package, uh, and I think they sell them by one use because I think one one mask is $7.50, which is kind of expensive. I will say that. But of all the masks I've ever used, whether that's a mask you put on, you peel off, 
whether it's a heavy duty exfoliant mask you have to leave on, any of the, any leave on product I've ever used, this by far knocks it out of the park. So I put on the mask, and I wish, I mean, I didn't save it, obviously. I should have taken pictures, but um, it was a cotton mask that fits in your face. You have eye holes and a nose hole and a mouth hole. When I put it on, it's very, very heavy with the serum that is used. Um, it's meant to, you know, some masks are meant to remove impurities and, and you know, and help dull skin. But this one really adds a little more. It, it's meant to not only do that, but infuse moisturizer. So you, I, wear, I wore the mask for 20 minutes. I will tell you, I looked like the scene from Mrs. Doubtfire when Robin Williams came out of the, of the refrigerator and goes, hello, and had the icing all over his face. That's what I kind of look like. And, um, you know, it didn't bother me. Some commenters on the reviews have said, on the product side, have said, you know, I couldn't breathe and it was too much, whatever. I mean, it really was not that bad. Once you take the mask off, this little thing's killing me here, this flop flop. Once you, I took the mask off, the serum that's left on your face, you're to rub it in. Mm. Now, people, that is the best part of this mask. Because if you've used masks before, you take off the, you might, it might be a peel off mask, it might be a wash off mask, it may be an actual mask you put on. When you take it off, you typically have to clean your face again, like, you know, rinse your face. Um, I've never had a mask where they've said, now, whatever's left on your face, just rub it in. But this one is how it is made, and it is the bomb. I love this. I literally will be buying this in the future. I have put this on my favorites list on Birchbox because this is wonderful. I would recommend it. Now, I don't have a, I don't have a lot of trouble with, like, a really dry skin on my face, but... You want to know why? It's because I, I take care of my skin and I use lots of, I use good products on it and clean product and pure products. But what I would recommend with this is if you're going to be traveling via airplane and you know we're hitting in the holiday season, people are traveling, I would make sure you pack one of these away so that when you get off the plane and you get your destination, you can do a hot, because you get real dry on an airplane. I would also say these are great in, especially in the winter time when wind is whipping and it's making your skin all, you know, dry and nasty. I would love one of these for my hands. Like I wish there were gloves that they made that I could put on it and that would solve my dry hand problem, I'm certain. But can't say enough about this. This was worth every penny of my Birch Box. Um, so really big fan of that. I could talk for days about that, but you don't want to hear it. Okay, the next item is the Balm Cosmetics Frat Boy Blush Shadow. And this, the regular size retails for $21. And you'll see I've used it. Um, it's, it's got a little football field thing there. And it is called a blush or shadow, but I've used it mainly as a, as a blush. Um, not sure, I've not tried to use it as, as a shadow yet. Um, I love the Balm Cosmetics. I love all their products. I have a bronzer right now that I'm using. Uh, I had an eyeshadow I used for a while. Um, I do like their products. Here's my beef about the Balm. The samples are just hard, hard to use, okay? So look at this. Okay, this is like probably less than an inch, maybe an inch and a half of a space. I can't get my brush in there. Like, I, how am I supposed to use that, you know? I can probably swatch some here on my arm, my hand to show you. But this is not something that is easy to use with your brushes. The bronzer is the same way. And I mean, my whole my whole bronzer, that this whole part right here, the bronzer is all brown. Because I just, you know, I try to get some on my brush. So that's the only thing I don't like about the samples of the balm. So I've put a little bit on my hand. You can kind of see right there, um, that's the, the rosy glow that you have with this. It's, it's meant to give, uh, give you a rosy natural, rosy natural glow. Um, I think it does a really good job. Um, I think I'm going to have to invest some time in actual full-size balm cosmetics so that I can really get the full effect of them. Same thing with the eyeshadow, although the brushes are smaller for the eyeshadow, so I could actually get into the sample. But the bronzer and the blush, it's, it's tough. 
I probably should just use my finger, but that seems a little silly. But um, this, I don't know if I said how much this, this retails for $21, the full size. Okay. Now the last product is LOC, which is a new uh, beauty brand that is Birchbox brand by Tati, who does the um, a lot of the videos for Birchbox. This is one of the shadow sticks in the one and done shadow trio uh, stick trio called Rise and Shine. And the color that and this is this was the sample that I got to pick. Now I have I've achieved the Birchbox Aces Birch Box Aces level, which means. I have earned 500 points, and so now I get everything ahead of time. So I get to pick my sample a week before anybody else. Like, I picked my sample for December box to, uh, yesterday. So, you know, when, when I was before I was an ace, I never got to pick because by the time I got there, everything was, you know, you just had to take what you were given, which was fine. So this is this is one of the colors in the trio that that retails for twenty five dollars if you got all three of them, and we just got one. And this is silvery taupe. It's called on point, or I guess, as the cool kids say, fleek, on fleek. And let me just give you a little swatch here of what it looks like. So that's the color. I really like it. It's very different. The, the silvery taupe is definitely a great way to describe it. Um, it's very good for all around, um, all over eyeshadow. So, you know, you don't have to, you can just take it. When I've worn it, I've put it all over my eyes. It just works really well. Now, the trio for $25 also comes with a sharpener. I have a sharpener, so I'll be able to do that with this. Um, but, you know, this is a, a Birchbox brand, and it's very reasonably priced. I mean, I would say if you were to get this same uh, trio of something, in any other brand, you might be paying forty dollars for it. Um, it is retails at thirty-five. Birchbox is running a special for twenty-five right now. Um, you know, I think the other colors are copper and a rose gold. Um, but I don't; those aren't colors I really use that often. So I kind of liked the more silvery color, um, and so I really liked it. Um, and I was glad I got to pick this. Uh, it was a choice between three of the shadows or three of the lipsticks, and I've got a ton of lipstick right now. I don't really need more, um, and I, so I thought I would try the shadow, um, and, and I really am glad I got it. So that was what was in my birch box this month. Now, what would I grade this birch box? I would give it, hmm, probably a B plus. I wouldn't give it an A just because there isn't more than maybe one of these products that I would actually buy again. All these products I'll use, no no problem. Uh, maybe there's two products here I would buy again. I'd probably buy the Balm again and, I'd, and the Dr. Jart, of course. Um, so B plus is what I would give it. Um, definitely worth my money's worth. I will use all of these and none of them are bad at all. It definitely beats Ipsy this month. Uh, if you haven't watched my Ipsy video, I'll link it in the description box below for November. Definitely beats Ipsy this month. Um, I just, I love Birchbox. I, what I love about it is that every time I review something, I get points. And I, I can buy products out of their store for so cheap. And I, I'm not kidding. I get emails every day from them on promo codes and offers. It's crazy. So, I like being able to buy the full the full size products of things very easily because it's right there on the site. Um, and like I mentioned, I am probably going to buy this Dr. Jart mask and keep a couple on hand to use when I really feel like I need need to use them. So that was my box for November. If you are a Birchbox subscriber, put in the comment section below what was your key win, you know, what was your winner winner chicken dinner product in your box this month. Be sure to put that in the comment section below. If you don't belong to Birchbox and you would like to join, I'll have a link down in my description box um, where you can click through and join. It's only $10 a month. Uh, you get five either deluxe samples, full size sample, full size products or deluxe samples. Um, and some months you get more than five. I've been, I've been surprised a couple of months of having about one month I had, I think, seven or eight. Um, so don't don't miss uh, signing up if you're not a member. I think it's you definitely get your money's worth every month. It's it's ten dollars, you know, way more than ten dollars worth of product. 
And be sure you give this a big thumbs up. Make sure you like this video. And if you're not a subscriber to my channel, mm, why not? Ask yourself, why not? You need to subscribe so that you don't miss any of my videos. And if there's something you'd like me to review, it can be anything whatsoever. Be sure to put that in the comment section below. I love to get ideas on things that I can review on this channel. All right, well, thanks so much, everyone, for joining me today, and I'll see you next time. Bye!